Good morning class. Today we are going to discuss about your next topic that is safety from fire. See in other lectures we have discussed about the safety on the road. Now we are going to discuss about your safety from fire. See fire is very dangerous. It can take a person life also. So it is very necessary for you to follow some safety rules when there are fires so that you can save your life and others life also okay so that no unwanted accidents can happen see the first rule is do not play with the matchstick see when there are things that might catch fire you should never play with matchstick around them next one is do not wear synthetic clothes because that clothes can catch fire easily so you are always told that you should not wear synthetic clothes and you should not wear uh, you should not come in the kitchen while wearing synthetic clothes so always wear cotton clothes when there are the things which might uh, which might catch fire on and when there is fire involved see next one is if you are in the kitchen and the gas is on unnecessarily you should turn off the knob and if you suspect a gas leak around your house what you must do is you must open all the doors and windows of your houses so that gas can go out see sometimes because the because of the power supply because of the surge of power supply what happens some electrical appliances catches fire right then you what you must do see you can't put water on that fire because that will cause a electric shock and the person who is putting water on that can get caught and he or she might die so you must never use water for putting out the fire on the electrical appliances for that you must use fire extinguishers and also you can use the sand you can throw the sand on that fire so that you can put out that electrical fire next one the fire involving the petrol see you must have seen that petrol floats on water right whenever there is fire involved and that fire is caused because of the petrol you must never use water on that see because the petrol will floats on water and burning will occur so what you must do is you must use sand or mud on that fire so that you can put out that fire next one is sometimes people get accidentally cat catch on fire right they got fire so what they must do is they must not run see running makes the fire burn faster so you must not run and what you do is you must roll down on the floor or on the sand so that you can put out the fire see do not panic at that situation just roll on the floor so that you can put out the fire next one is when there is fire in the building what you must do first first rule is you must not go into the lift go down from the stairs and quickly vacate that building when you hear the fire alarm quickly vacate the building and you must not use lift you you should only use stairs see next one is if there is smoke you should crawl down to the exit next is safety from electricity see what rule you should follow so that you can be safe from electric shock see first rule is do not insert anything into the sockets and do not use wet hands while switching on the fans next one is do not put too many appliances into one socket see what happens is there will be a surge of power supply and it can make a fire go around so you should never plug too many appliances in one socket
Next one is you should never touch a loose wire. Whenever you see a loose wire, you should ask an electrician so that you can get it fixed. See, next one is do not fly kites around the power line. See, you can get electrical shocks from that. So, in this lecture, we have discussed about your safety from fire and safety from electricity. Okay class, this will be all for today. Thank you for listening.